It's veterans who pass away while far from family or don't have a relation with family members are often laid to rest alone or without a proper military burial. But one local group is making sure that is never the case here in Kern County. 23 ABC's Vanya Patino takes a look at an unaccompanied veterans ceremony where the greater military community showed up to claim these veterans as their own. For those in attendance, this day represents the unity and respect within the military. Pass away October 15th. One by one, the names of the veterans were read. The honor guard performed the rifle salutes and trumpets briefly covered the sound of rain as military service men and women bowed their heads to pay their respects. It's just really an amazing thing to be able to stand in and say I'm here for them. Just like we were for each other, we always had each other's backs when we were in the military and now we have their back this time as they're laid to rest and being able to salute them with a proper military send off. The American flag was folded and handed to Debbie Duffel who comes from a long line of military servicemen in her family. This was her first time being able to step in to receive the flag. The military as a whole is a family and to be able to be part of that family is, is very, it's very heartwarming. Combat veteran Benjamin Palmer is no stranger to these ceremonies. In fact, he has been attending as part of the honor guard for the past 15 years. He says the circumstances as to why these veterans died with no one to claim them should not diminish their sacrifice. Uh, they're still veterans, no matter what happened to them afterwards. They're still veterans. You know, some of them had mental problems. Some of them just had financial problems. But it's good that they they have family here. You know, even if it's not blood family, it's military family and veterans family. And although the ceremony was limited in capacity due to COVID-19 restrictions, those who would like to pay the respects are encouraged to do so by bringing wreaths to these graves. At the Bakersfield National Cemetery, Vonnie Patino, 23ABC, connecting you.